All right, so here I got my LG G5, and Fortnite runs like total garbage. It actually runs no better on the S9 from what I saw, but I want to start off with Utah Macross and then go to Fortnite because Utah Macross upon its own is a pretty graphically intense game for it being just a simple music rhythm game. The only reason why not hearing any audio from the game is due to copyright crap. Now, is there any way I can play this comfortably? Not really. Okay, which one is the one they had? They three. Not that. Or if you do something out here, music is going to be very faint. Man, that's the worst I ever did with that song. Of course, granted, I'm playing this. Granted, I have the screen like four or five feet. Of, well, I don't do four, but like three feet away from my face, which is not normally how I play this game. So my uh, register, so my hit registry is gonna be fucking garbage, as you saw. But, <clears throat> even though I was total garbage, you got to see that the game itself runs relatively smooth for what this phone is. It plays at 60 FPS all the time. There is an occasional frame drop here and there, but most of the time this game plays perfectly fine. So if I drop over to Port Knight, I feel so ashamed I did that bad. I mean, I will occasionally miss, but for goodness sakes. I sucked. Good night. This game takes longer to load than Newton Macross. 
And that game has to uh, communicate to a server all the way over in Japan. Just that frame rate right there at the, just the initial load shows how bad this game runs. And I know this is a beta, but when it comes to uh, what what this game's supposed to be able to run on, the G5 is on their uh, is on their site for what the game is can support. This frame rate is abysmal. Because playing like you're told to is too difficult. This is, I think it's like 20 frames, maybe. Well, I think it was like 15 frames. And here's the thing, uh, you, not you, Tim Macross, but uh, the PUBG mobile game runs better than this. Which I actually should start off with uh, that because that's the uh, competitor for Fortnite. But I want to start off with Utah Macross because Utah Macross upon itself is a pretty graphically intense game for what it is. I haven't played the mobile version of Pub Wii in a while, but even I know that mobile version runs significantly better than this. Like right here, it's getting decent frame rates, and of course, if I do this, frame rate goes to full 30. Capped FPS is stupid. Seriously, this frame rate is abysmal. And I'm recording this video at 60 FPS. Is there any way I can I can hold this thing and actually play it? Because I really can't play it like that. And the thing is, I know it's not my phone because my phone runs the stock the uh, mobile version for pub we just fine and it just crashed Yeah, um... Yeah, if you're gonna ban me for lag, fuck you and fuck off. Just for kicks, I decided to reinstall this game just to prove my point. Also, fuck you, I don't care about that movie. Now, of course, right here, they're just in the uh, load screen. And, it's all, and the frame rate's already significantly better than in Fortnite. Other than the initial load, which is to be expected, it's running so much smoother. You gotta remember, this is their competitor.
Now I am using a uh, <clears throat> guest uh, guest account because um, I don't feel like re-logging back into this game because I'm just going to uninstall it after this video. I only just reinstalled it again to just prove my point. And that logo right there looks like the logo from Across Delta. Just saying. Okay, where did I want to drop again? I want to drop right of the vehicle. I'm going to be the asshole that runs people over. Really hard. Also, I set everything to high. I didn't say everything. I didn't do any of this because it's not because these two settings are not. Uh, my phone doesn't support those two settings. Well, the game says it doesn't support it. Is there any way I can make this any closer? No, there really isn't. Granted, you already get the German idea to see how well the game already runs. Tree. Again, with the way I'm playing this game, my, uh, blah, I'm going to be shit. Just like in YouTube Across, playing this game at, at the angle I'm playing it instead of, like, literally in front of my face doesn't really help. Also note how I haven't been kicked yet for false for uh, lagging. That's a shoddy, so I'll put that there. It's a fucking burster. The only burst weapon I'm good with is the BR and Halo Reach. I'll just keep going until I die. That's pretty much how I'm going to do this video. Oh look a car, I can be the asshole that runs people over. I wonder if they nerfed the car by any chance. Oh yeah, I'm only level one, so I'm gonna be up with AI for I'm gonna be up up against AI for the most part. So it's not really gonna be a uh, real representation of my skill. Well, in the end, it really doesn't matter. I'm just going to install this game after this video anyways. But I can definitely say for sure that uh, when this game first came out, it didn't run as good on this phone, but still ran better than Fortnite did. But they have significantly, uh, they have significantly improved the, uh, mobile ver the, uh, the mobile version pretty well since the last time I've actually played something.
I'm just, no, I'm not going to. I'm considering doing a clickbaity title, but I'm not going to. I'm almost most likely going to be Fortnite Android or Fortnite on LG phone or something. I don't know. Fortnite on LG G5 is fucking garbage or something like that. I'm not going to use. I'm not going to say effing because I do want people to see this video. There you are. There we go. No, he's still alive. Why are you not dead yet? There we go. God, it's like the fucking B11 in GTA. Oh, there you are, I see you. AI. It just stayed there and took it. Explains why I was able to land shots at me at distance too. I need a brighter screen so I can actually see what's on the display and whatnot. Oh, so that's what that does? Hmm. I'll just, nah, I'm just gonna be the asshole and run people over. Well, of course, I still won't last as long as I can. I mean, I already gotten this far, I'm just still gonna be the asshole that runs people over. Go, oh, bitch. Doesn't this thing have nitro or something? Yeah, it does. Now of course my phone's warming up. But it's still running very but still running fairly smooth. I wonder how well this I wonder how well this game would run if I had, this thing was passive well not passive but uh, active cooled. Okay.
Just sit there and take it. There you go. Ew. Sorry about that. Frame rate. Didn't they just have like an MS counter somewhere on here? Here it is. I got an MS of 20. Which means if I if my ping is 20, that means the server I'm running on is over in Texas. Oh, how did I not kill you? I was going full speed. There we Again, I'm playing this at such an awkward angle. This phone is from 2015 and it's running this game just fine. Yeah, it can't run Fortnite. At the beginning, I was getting 60 FPS, I believe. But now, since my phone's warmed up quite a bit, the thing's the thing is thermal throttling. That's why I was that's why I was wondering if a uh, if this game if this game will actually run better if, it, if this thing was was uh, active cooled. He just literally sat there and took it. Well, again, if you're going to get an AI, it's going to take it. Closing.
I'm bored. I'll never understand why people like these games. AI. Oh yeah, and before you say you're bored because you're playing an AI match, it doesn't matter if I'm playing an AI match or if I'm using my actual main account, which is above level 10, I think it's like 15 or something, and I'm going up against real players, I'm still bored. The frame drops are real. Oh, I see you. I see both of you. Rip one. Rip two. Dead or alive, so there we go. Yeah, that one's dead. Up, see one in the water. Dude, this thing's sucking my battery down. Oh, again, this phone is old, and I'm using a third party. Can someone kill me already on board? I could drown myself, I don't feel like doing that. Another AI? What's with the AI in water? My aim sucks. It's like they go Master Chief and just stop working.
Yep, you're just gonna sit there and take it, aren't you, you little AI? Take it right in the butt. Oh, that's an actual person. And you took it in the butt. And you're dead. Now, where does that drop? Oh, it's right here. I wonder if there's anything more. Hello. Mr. AI, how are you? Mr. AI, and you're dead. Poor AI. The AI in uh, Overwatch are more competent than these. So am I like the only living person? Well, no, I killed someone else and I was actually, I was actually someone. Okay, so my AI I have locked on to someone, I think. Oh, I see you. Okay. Where are you? There you are. Yeah, not the actual person. Anyway, it's the person dead if it was an actual person. One more alive, we got opted.
Piece of shit. Ugh. God, 30 minutes? Fuck! It's one of the reasons why I don't play these games. So, well, I'm gonna do one more thing before I actually. Leaves, I want to try something. Where is it? Armory? Where is it? Inventory? It's inventory. Or. You actually get to keep the crap you salvage at the very end, or. Really? You don't get to keep the uh, stuff you got? Because I know I got that stupid stupid helmet thing. Well, in the end, that's one of the only other reasons why I downloaded this game was to uh, test and see if you actually get to keep the crappy salvage, which you don't. So, with that said, Epic, get on your game. Your competitor runs better on my phone than your actual game does. That's legitimately sad. So back to playing YouTube Macross.